हेलो फ्रेंड्स थैंक यू फॉर लाइकिंग एंड सब्सक्राइबिंग माय यूट्यूब चैनल फॉर पावर प्लांट गुरुज फ्रेंड्स आई एम ए मैकेनिकल इंजीनियर विथ ट्वेंटी इयर्स ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस एंड आई एम कैलकटा एलोमनी सो आई वांटेड टू मेक दिस सीरीज फॉर शेयरिंग माय नॉलेज विथ हु वॉन्ट्स टू गेन नॉलेज इन पावर प्लांट so here comes the video uh, uh, based on one comments i received for making a video on gas turbine inlet guide vanes so uh, we shortly call it as a igv so gas turbine uh, igv is a very important part in terms of construction as well as in terms of operation also so uh, in last video we saw how air is getting filtered from inlet filter house and coming to gas turbine now how to control the quantity of air which is coming to turbine as we all know that uh, during startup it may require a small amount of air at uh, let's say 50% load it will uh, ask for a different amount of air and if operates on the full load then it will ask for a different amount of air so all that air flow is to be regulated and controlled so igv does that function for gas turbine so uh, here what we can see uh this these are the igv vanes and here is the mechanism which turns these individual vanes so what will happen right now we what we can see is that path is full open and if we turn this all uh, levers or small levers down this blade will turn and this blade will will uh, turn and try to close this path so at uh, maximum uh, i mean the minimum position also this will not be fully closed there will be some minimum amount of air will be so this image we saw in the last uh, slide now this is the actual image how a gas turbine igv looks like uh, the left one is a um, uh, graphical representation while the right one is a actual how it looks like so these are the uh, blades which are shown up like in a closed condition here it is a open condition so these small uh, what we call can say pinions are here like this and how this is up here it is uh -huh. so uh, what we saw that pinions these are small gears very small gears individually uh, uh, arranged for one blade like this each blade will have this sort of one small pinion and all this pinion will be connected to this rack this rack connected to this rack what we can see in the background and how this will be operated so this uh, rack will move in both direction to make it close and open and as we know that during operation lot amount of air will be passing through so that it will need a very high amount of uh, force or torque to uh, operate this so uh, gas turbine hydraulic oil system does this work here uh, in the right side of image we can see this is a hydraulic system which is connected to a piston and here in this box we cannot see but uh, this will be our rack which is a dust cover just to protect it and this piston is connected to this uh, rack rack is this portion beside uh, the pinions so this will uh, piston will move up and down and in turn this uh, rack will move in the both direction forward and reverse and that movement will turn these small pinions and those small pinions will change the angle of igv to open or close so what happens uh, uh, many people get confused with the uh, opening percentage igv so igv opens around uh, let's say 34 to 84 or 86 degrees so wherever we see that opening it is in degrees not the percentage so 34 degree is the minimum opening 84 or 86 is the full opening so uh, this is how the igv operates 
it depends upon machine to machine let's say ge machines operate from 34 to 84 or maybe 86 but if you see the mitsubishi mhi make uh, gas turbines uh, their 45 degree is full closed condition and minus 5 degree is full open condition. So we need not to be confused with this information. It may change from uh, OEM to OEM. So this is how I make a very small video on IGV. This is only constructional feature how it operates. In the next video we will discuss this op its uh, operation details also like IGV temperature control on and off, how it opens up in startup, part load and base load. Uh, yeah, thank you. Please subscribe my channel and ask your any query in comments. People uh, try to uh, put likes and comments on Facebook uh, page, but uh, it would help if you do it on uh, YouTube also. Thank you. Thank you very much.